but we only sold two we only sold uh, how many 10 units how many left so we're gonna say the cost the cost per unit the cost per unit is 7.3 so 7300 multiply by two units so these are left then we're gonna go to another one we go to april 7.8 per unit we bought eight we sold five gonna gonna take eight uh seven thousand eight hundred seven thousand eight hundred per unit times by how many three units three units now we're gonna uh write down there everything so here we're gonna take our calculator there just go with me and calculate this units cost let's go for six thousand okay for sure this one is just six thousand five hundred there's no need to calculate there anything and then you go to the next one uh six thousand eight hundred multiply by five then we have thirty four thousand rand thirty four thousand rand then let's go to another one another one is seven thousand three hundred let's go to seven thousand three hundred now seven thousand three hundred seven thousand three hundred multiply um by two units it gives us fourteen thousand fourteen thousand six hundred then let's go to the last one the last one is seven thousand eight hundred rand times by three units times by three units it gives us twenty three thousand twenty three thousand uh, how many how many how much 23,400 23,400 but now if you add all this thing together it must give you it must give you an amount of uh let's add it together 23,400 plus 14 say plus 14 14,600 let's go again plus 34,000 rand Let's go again, plus 6,500. Okay, there is equal to 78,500. So this is the money that we were looking for, 78,500. So this is what we call closing stock. Why closing stock is because if you see, notice one unit was left, and uh, five units were left, two units were left, and three units. Were left. So these are closing balances of the units bought. There, these are the cost, uh, the cost price per unit. Now, the, our money there is equal to seventy-eight 